Oh, hail the beard, it's your boy Big Beard B, and we back for another edition of Big Beard Business. In today's video, we're discussing the brand new, the newest addition to the collection. We talking about none other than the Or Own Sport, the 2017 version. Now, I know you guys like to see the presentation. Here you go, you got a box, you got red. Done, all right? Now, let's get into what really matters, the juice. So we got, just in traditional fashion of Christian Dior fragrances, you have the clear bottle. You got the black stem with a hint of red there. CD on the front for Christian Dior. Who really cares about that, right? You got Dior Ohm written there. Really good atomizer there and really good all around fragrance. So let's hop into it. So as you guys know, there have been multiple formulations of Dior Own Sport. This is the latest flanker, the newest release. And this one is still very citrus heavy. And this one you got lemon, grapefruit, bergamot, and pear. This is a really nice all around fragrance. So unlike the previous formulations of this fragrance, the base now includes sandalwood and vetiver versus those woody notes that you had before. On the initial spray, this one opens up with heavy lemon, and grapefruit notes. This one's a nice, clean, creamy, fresh, aromatic spray. During the dry down of this is when you really get to get some of that spice and a little bit of the wood notes that are available in this fragrance. And despite the little bit of spice that you get on this one, this one is very acidic. It packs a very acidic punch. You know what I mean? Although this one to me is citrus heavy, I do not find it to be as citrus heavy as Dior Own Cologne. Still very nice fragrance. And I'm not overall a fan of many sport fragrances. I believe this is one of possibly two sport fragrances that I have in my collection. In my limited wearings of this one, I don't believe you're gonna get beastly performance, but this did make my summer 2017 list as I know that I'm going to wear the fuck out this one. Definitely to get some testing and then because it's new. All right, so I'll link that video here. If you haven't seen it yet, make sure you go ahead and check it out. For me, the longevity on this is around four to six hours, which in my personal opinion, I think that's great for a sport fragrance. And if you're trigger happy, I think you can get about two hours on a projection and sillage on this fragrance. I'm just Overall, it's a very nice fragrance. So if you do that, I don't think anyone's going to be upset. I haven't worn it enough to understand what the compliments are going to be like, so I'll go through and comment below once I get enough wearings. Let you know the type of compliments that I receive on this. I can tell you from first reactions, my wife really likes it, and there was a lot of people inside Macy's purchasing this fragrance. So to me, it's going to get compliments. Price point on this one, you got two sizes available. I believe you have a 2.4 and I believe a 4.2. This is the 4.2 ounce. So it's from 74 to 94 bucks. Not bad for a Dior fragrance. So with taxes, you're probably coming in right under 100 bucks. I don't believe this one's going to be available on any great market sites yet because it's just a newer fragrance and it's a little more difficult to find them at a discounted price when they come out. Now, is it worth the $74.94? bucks? In my personal opinion, it is. Now, I know there are going to be a lot of you out there who disagree. There's going to be a lot of you out there that say, meh, I don't really care for the fragrance. And hey, man, I get it. Fragrance is objective. You can feel how you feel. But I like this fragrance. And I think from the Dior Own Sports that I've smelled so far, this is the only one to make me pull the trigger to buy it. That stated, you can't get a great market. You're going to have to look for your big box retailers. That one should be readily available. And it should have it prominently displayed as the new fragrance. But I would still just make sure they're not holding on to any old inventory and ask, hey, is this the 2017 formulation? Are you selling me that new, new? Or are you selling me that old shit? They should tell you they're selling you the new. Like, oh, this is the newest one. This, you're going to like it. Try it. Buy it. Let me hound you around the store and give you every fragrance that you might not like because I didn't ask you any questions about what you like. Just smell this and smell this and smell this. Get out of my face! Look, man, that's my take on Dior Own Sport 2017. On a compliment level, I don't know what it's going to be at, so my rating is going to be a little weird. So on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give it on my personal take my personal opinion now once i start getting some compliments i'm sure to go up but right now it's a 7.5 7.5 for me what you think Hi. and she agrees it's your boy big baby like comment subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend that we back again and it's getting sporty this summer oh yeah hit the goddamn bell <laughs> no man, no man, no.